Hi, my name is Jesse, and I'd like to share how I created some of the sounds for Mortal Empire, our recently released strategic role-playing game. You have my blade. What is the plan? I am yours. Mortal Empire has a lot of different spells, monsters, and equipment that your characters can use. So there was a lot of audio that I had to record. Start off with the sound I needed to create. That might be flapping wings, could be swinging a sword, or equipping armor. Now I'm not an expert, and I don't have much to work with here. I didn't create all the sounds for the game, but for the ones that I did make, I had to get a bit creative in finding something to make the right sound. from Ontario, like me, you'll recognize this. It's a crokinole board. And for whatever reason, this is what I use to drop a lot of things on. If I hit the objects a little differently, I was surprised to find I could get a lot of different variation in tone. Sometimes what I picked up at first didn't work out, so I had to improvise. My belt ended up being used for a lot of the sounds in the game. Finally, I'd transfer the recorded sounds to the computer, and then typically mash the sounds together to get the final effect. So here we have one of the sound effects from the game. This is a snare trap. It's a skill that one of the characters can use, and as you can hear, it's made up of three different components. The end bit here, is uh, some beads rattling around in a bag. The middle bit is the infamous belt with a uh, distortion effect. The beginning is me punching a phone book. And when they're blended together, it makes that sound. Now, I don't know if that's what a snare trap sounds like, but once it's in game, it actually works. So that shows you a little bit about the sound production for the game. Immortal Empire came out of beta in May of 2013. Just go to tacticstudios.com to check it out. sound.
effects, you don't want every single sound to sound the same. It sounds different. 